The UK agrotech environment is really built on the Britain's great agricultural heritage. The, the agricultural revolution happened a long time before the industrial revolution and we've continued as a country to develop as a leading agricultural producer. You combine that with outstanding research and development, great technical advances and we're really making progress on some of the key challenges that the world faces today, feeding the planet and not doing any further damage to the environment. Well, there are three th great things about UK Agritech. The first is that we've got world-class science, some of the best universities in the world, like Cambridge, Oxford and uh, Reading, and uh, they're doing cutting-edge work in Agritech. The second is that we've got a fully integrated food supply chain, right from primary producers through to manufacturers, through to retailers. It's all joined up. It's a great place to do business. And the third is we've got a very dynamic uh, uh, centre of uh, business, a gateway to Europe, and uh, that's why the UK is a great place to work. UK's uh, reputation in science and research actually attracts quite a lot of interest from the Chinese side. So the Chinese business leaders would very much to have a stake in UK market or to uh, invest in the UK so they could you know, improve their competitiveness in the global market. Yeah, trying to tap into you know, UK's reputation uh, in such a way. This is one side. Being in the UK is very important to Syngenta, particularly in research. So we have been doing research in uh, the Jellots Hill Research Centre in Berkshire for over 80 years. And agrochemical research at Jellots Hill has contributed to many innovations in agriculture and changed the way that the world does agriculture. Well, New Zealand is not alone in this, uh, in, in being an agricultural country. Uh, the UK is very largely an agricultural country, several others around the world. So we need to collaborate. If we just look at the field of bioprotection, for instance, there are several thousand diseases which can affect crops in New Zealand at one end of the season, also in the UK. We need to share information between these two countries and between others around the world. So John Deere, we don't have a research uh, facility here in the UK, but the need for that research in big data is there. And I think with our technology center in, in Germany, we could work together with Rothamsted and to uh, yeah, to make progress in that, that area of precision farming because so far the technology is there but some of the recipes, what are we doing with all this data is still missing and with working together we can really, our customers can benefit if they can easily use research results from Rothamsted on our machines.